You know, suddenly, I now have this song going through my head. Tonight there's gonna be a jailbreak here in Sydney Mine. Tonight there's gonna be a jailbreak. And now it ends up. Yep. Clearly too tired for this. Oh, no, not spiders again. Not again. At least I am not alone in the fire use. Now we have metal monsters. I think I'm just gonna loot whatever. Ooh, soul gems. I must be just powering them. Uh, I don't know how I'm supposed to support you guys with me surrounding it. Do what I can. Miko, gotta press forward because of Miko. Let's see. Is it this way? Do we have any more of these monstrosities to fight? Apparently not. Good. Adenok, I brought what you asked for. Good work. Get ready while I have a word with our favorite outsider. I had Kai recover all the things the Nords stole from you. Better get ready before we break out into the city. And take this. It's blessed with the old magics. Oh, thank you, Madanok. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. What happens now? Even though, why do I care? I'm getting out of here. I'm not going to follow you guys. But thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Now, I announce to all of Markarth that I have returned. Don't worry about your name. They'll know who to blame and fear after today. It'll take years, but I'll organize the Forsworn again. We'll reclaim our land, and then when power is ours, we'll have peace. A kingdom. Until then, let me offer you a warning. I wish you Beware the best Beware the Forsworn. No place in the Reach is safe from us now. Thank you for the warning. Oh. Wait. Okay. Let's see. My backpack? Yes. Now I can pack some things in. I'm not much of an armor person. Oh, that'll be good. My bearskin cloak. Still need to wash it though. My boots and clothes because I am very tired of these foot wraps. My Ring of Magicka. My circlet. Do I still have my food? Oh, oh yeah. Yes. Eating, eating. Time to escape this hellhole. fight to them. Gotta sleep under the stars. Gotta gather firewood. Okay. Yep. They're fighting. They're all clearly fighting. 
But I am getting the heck out of here. Gotta find a nice hill to sleep on. Well, found a nice place. Just a matter of setting up camp. Let's see if I can remember how to do this. First, placing down the tent so that way I have some place to rest. And then... It is... and now... It is a matter of... Getting... The, uh... The right amount of... Of wood, branches, and wood shavings for a campfire. Going realistic. All right. Just need enough dead wood and branches. Oof. Didn't realize that this mountain would be cold. Thank you, Miko. Still going to get more. Well, seems to be good to have Miko around. Dogs and sticks, am I right? Ooh. Talk about cold. Now it's raining. Oh, my fur. Okay. I think that should be enough. Getting very tired. First, let's make some wood shavings. Let's add some branches. The wood shavings for catching fire. This is gonna take a while because it is raining, but I'll give my assistance with my fire spells. Come on. Fur is over something. Continue adding on and make the fire bigger. Putting on the dead wood, but not covering up the fire to a point where it can't breathe. Having a little chat there, are we, Miko? Ugh. Ugh. I already feel myself falling asleep. Well then. You keep watch, Miko. Wake me up when trouble comes around. Other than that, I think I'll see you tomorrow evening.
much. Who's there? Who are you? vision. And if that was 
Pass of Vision. The land of perpetual autumn. My mom. She once talked about that place. It's called the Rift. This will be my first time going. I better get everything packed up, prepared. Why did that vision have to be in the memory that I had of the day following Mom's funeral? daily prayer. Good day, Lady Ma. What a day it is. What a week it has been. Be okay, Miko. But thank you, boy. That's why I pet him. Such a good boy. The sky bound heroes is for the true outriders to see. There was a vision. He was somewhat obscured yet. Skybound hues. He would be much brighter than that. Oh well. <sighs> you know what? I know that deep down I would rather avoid. Markarth for as long as I can. But I can't have Birna traveling by the side of the carts being overburdened. So, I'm gonna sell some things. Huh? Oh, Cory. Alright. Talk to me. I've been looking for you. Got something I'm supposed to deliver. Your hands only. Let's see here. Looks like that's it. Got to go. Hmm. What is it? Oh! Second planting. That's upcoming. Free clinics at temples are open for the last time this year. Sons. And then 
will make my way to Afton. by carriage. As safe as that journey was, as tiring as it has been, all that rocking, all that climbing, it came me glad that the inside of it was very warm. Now I need to sleep. Hold there. Before I let you into Riften, you need to pay the visitor's tax. I'm very much about to have an aneurysm here. What's the tax for? Oh, the privilege of entering the city. What does it matter? I hope you can pardon me, sir. But I've just had a long week, and I am fucking tired. I am in no mood for shakedowns. So please, let me in. Alright, keep your voice down. You want everyone to hear you? I'll let you in. Just let me unlock the gate. If I hear of another shakedown, I'm going to announce it to the whole world. The gate's unlocked. You can head inside when you're ready. Thank you, and I am ready right now. Right. It had a reason why mom didn't bring me here. Let's just get to an end. Yep, and right there's the reason why my mom didn't bring me with her on her last pilgrimage. Now I remember that there's a temple of Mara here. They represent the reason I'm here. I can't just ignore them, Erin. I know. I just don't want you to. I'm really getting tired of your excuses. When you borrowed the money, you said you'd pay it back on time for double the usual fee. I know I did. But how was I to know the ship would get rocked? This must be the Next inn. time, keep your plans quiet, and nothing would have happened to you. What? Are you telling me you robbed Yep, this Why? is the inn, all right. Are you doing this to me? If you've got the coin, you've come to the right place. Pull up a seat. Thank you, ma'am. I'm hoping you have enough... Um, Pardon. I'm tired. If you've got the coin, you're welcome here. Otherwise, hit the road. Yeah, I will. But first, I'm looking for work. Here, take a look at this. Some of the Jarl's men came by and left this bounty letter. Bounty bandits. And I'm wondering if you have enough room here for a bard. I'd like to perform here. It's not going to be for very long, though. It's just for a room. But I do hope that you like. Of course. Alright, everyone. One tired bard about to play you a sweet, sweet tune. Nothing like a soft bed, warm food, and a good boy pooch by my side. <laughs> yeah, I decided to give him a little bit of cooked beef. Not exactly healthy, but, oh, he deserves it. Isn't that right, boy? <laughs> That's right. Right, let's, uh... Let's go see if that vision is um, is correct. 
and this strong arm is here. Never done an honest day's work in your life for all that coin you carry. Alas. Pardon me, sir. What exactly do you mean by that? I'm saying you've got the coin, but you didn't earn a septum of it honestly. I can tell. I actually did. And my wealth is none of your business. Oh, but that's where you're wrong, lass. Wealth is my business. Maybe you'd like a taste. I don't have much time today, so... Just tell me what you would have me do. I've got a bit of an errand to perform, but I need an extra pair of hands. And in my line of work, extra hands are well paid. Okay. Get to the point, please. Simple. I'm going to cause a distraction. You're gonna steal Medesi's silver ring from the strong box under his stand. Once you have it, I want you to place it in Branche's pocket without him noticing. Break the law? Are you kidding me? No thanks. Oh, sorry. I usually have a nose for this kind of thing. Never mind then, lass. If you change your mind, come find me. Could be later, but... Not like for sure. Not right now. Like oh, sir. Sure, sure. I'm a dirty beggar. Why would you want to even speak to me? Here. Oh, Have a coin you. on me. Divines bless your kind heart. Uh huh. Genuine Falmer blood elixir for sale. Live for thousands of years. All right. Now that that is out of the way, Looking let's visit alive. the Temple of Mora. Yep, this is clearly the place. I'll pray to here. Hundred gold as an offering. Again, my apologies for well, for forgetting my prayers, but the journey has been long. And so far mentally difficult. I'm starting to believe these voices, though. Are they really vision bringers? Parts of my soul? If they are, they must be of the creation of you or of any one of the other seven. If that is the case, then you have my thanks. If not... Then may Nern have pity on my soul. Okay, so I've got my prayers done, and I've talked to the head priest here. I gave him the nutshell of my journey so far, told him about my mother, and he sold me an amulet that is very similar to hers. The amulet of Mara. Now, let's go and get this ally. Yep. 
This is the jail right here. Let's hope that he really is here. Hey, you're not supposed to be down here. Official business only. It's fine. Marlon Mall said that that it would be safe for me to come down here because he knows of the one that you have inside of your cells. Oh, my mistake then. Sorry, you can go on ahead. Thank you, sir. You really take your job seriously. I like that. Crazy Kashit. Important. The crazy Khajiit in cell one is not to be disturbed. He paid us good money for that cage, so don't go bothering him. If he's still here in a month, I think we should enforce a little rent increase. I doubt we'll be able to, um, I doubt we will get the chance, though. You've all seen the way he looks. Wouldn't be surprised if he tried to end his life soon. If you see him in a particularly suicidal mood, get in there and stop him. He's been using the key we gave him, so you need to... Um, so if you need in there in a hurry, use the spare and the broken strong box above the fireplace. Thank you for leaving that out for everyone to read. A dead man can't pay rent. Warden Norton. Above the fireplace. Oh! This is the only fireplace that I see, and here's the key. Thank you, sir. Yep, skybound hues indeed. Not really. Just very deep in blue. Hello. Come to kill me at the last, have you? Thank the gods. Kill you. I can bear the guilt no longer. Guilt? Excuse me? I know I must die. Beware, though. My newfound honor demands I defend myself. Um. That's a very strange sense of honor. Though the look in your eyes... Have we met? I am in no mood for jokes. Strike me down. Take your revenge. What? I honestly have no idea what you are talking about. Who are you? You don't remember? Uh, that is my fault also. I am your so-called friend, Inigo. I was the one who killed you. I tried anyway. I am guilty. Kill me. Uh... What? You tried to kill me? You really must me- must have me confused with someone else. Why exactly are you here? After I shot you, I finally realized my mistake and tried to turn myself in. Your body was gone, the guards did not believe me. They said I was wasting their time. I had to pay them to put me in this cell. It is where I belong. I needed to repent. I need to repent. Why do I got the feeling that these voices led me to a crazed skooma addict. I am not the person that you remember, Inigo. You are the person I remember. I would recognize your smell anywhere. My life is yours to take. Do it. First of all, 
I am no murderer. Second of all, if you recognize my scent, then you really do have me mistaken for someone else. Maybe you met my real mother and you killed her. Of that, I wouldn't put it against you. I never knew her, so... So... I'm... And I'm... <sighs> Sorry. I'm stuttering. I never knew my real mother. She could have been one of the most horrible, greedy people around. Regardless, my adoptive mother is the best mom in the world. For not only did she take care of me, but she was also a priestess of Mara. So let's agree to disagree. I could use some help if you're willing. Come to kill me at the last, have okay. you? I know I must have die. To go through all that dialogue I again. Am no you don't remember? After I shot you, they said I was wasting their time. You are the person I remember. I would recognize Let's agree your smell to disagree. anywhere. My I could use some help to take. if Do you're it. willing. Let's agree to disagree. I could use some help if you are willing. I fight with you? Yes, Inigo. I've been in worse... Even though this cell looks very comfortable, well kept, good job, it is still a cell. There is no need to waste your life waiting for someone to enact your rather strange form of penitence. Or die defending you. Yes, I accept. I feel lighter in my heart now you have given me this opportunity. You will not regret this. However, since you do seem to have the shakes, just watch where you aim that bow of yours. Do not joke about such things, my friend. The sadness I feel for what I have done is brutal enough. For now. This is going to be a strange journey in tea.